A vigil was held early this morning in Lac Mégantique to mark the 10-year anniversary of the deadliest rail disaster in modern Canadian history. A silent march began at 1.14 a.m., marking the moment an unattended train carrying crude oil derailed and exploded in the heart of town, killing 47 people. People wore star-shaped lights in memory of the victims. And Prime Minister Justin Trudeau will be there today for a mass. And for more on what's going on today, we're joined by CTV's Angela McKenzie. Good morning, Angela. If you can walk us through some of the vigils that we've already seen today and what else is planned throughout the day. Good morning, Scott. Well, it actually started very early this morning, as you mentioned. Um, there was this illuminated uh, walk through the downtown core from the church that's just behind me. Uh, and that involved hundreds of people from Lac Megantic, many of them, you know, family, friends, uh, people who knew a lot of the victims uh, who died in that disaster. Um, so for them, it was really an opportunity to gather, to, to honor the victims, and to really support each other through what is a very difficult day in this community. Um, they walked through the downtown core. They also stopped and, and, and spoke briefly uh, at a memorial, a commemorative uh, monument for um, the victims of the tragedy. And it was really, I was there that night, it was, it was really quite emotional. Um, what we're going to be seeing later this morning at 11 o'clock in, the, in this, the town's church, there is going to be a special service held in honor of the victims. Um, and they'll also be ringing out the bells for um, every single one of the people who died. They're also going to be going to that monument that I mentioned before and laying flowers uh, for the people who died as well. As I mentioned, the Prime Minister will be there for the Mass later today. What do we know about his involvement in the ceremonies and the, uh, the Mass and, and remembering the victims of this tragedy? Uh, it's unclear. You know, we really just got confirmation that he is going to be here. So I believe he will maybe make a brief statement outside of the church along with Premier Francois Legault. Um, so we do expect to, to hear from them briefly. Um, but as for the actual ceremony itself, I'm not sure he will be speaking, but rather just participating and being with the community in that moment. But that's still to be determined. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll have to wait and see. All right, Mark, in 10 years since this terrible tragedy, CTV's Angela McKenzie, thanks so much for the update on this.